Hey, my legion, how y'all doing? Uh, I want to show you something that my neighbors just got to me. I just woke up 11.46. <clears throat> I was up all night on a Google Hangout with a whole bunch of great people. And my neighbors dropped this off to my dad and myself, a whole bunch of Christmas cookies. And uh, there's like a banana bread in there, right here. There's two candy canes. It says Merry Christmas 2013. And uh, I thought I'd at least try like two of these cookies. You know, because for my dad, I thought I won't eat them all. You know, and my dad's real picky about the cookies anyway. Uh, let's open these up. <coughs> This was really very nice and I have to follow up and thank you. Because I don't make homemade Christmas cookies. These would be the first Christmas cookies I've tried so far this year. Um, I just want to do this too. Little reviews. Here are the these cookies right here that have like the maraschino cherry on them. Try this one. That was delicious. Because I don't make homemade Christmas cookies. I'm not really good. I probably could make them if I really tried. But this was really nice for our neighbors to send us this. And also, I have this. I think these are pecans on top of this. I believe there's a chocolate chip with pecans on it. Let's try this one out. That is really good. And before I get to the main review, I remember to check this out. This is a piece of uh, chocolate fudge. Let's try this on. That is awesome. That's really good point. So, I want to thank Larry and Ann. Those are the neighbors that brought this over. Thank you very much for all this cool stuff. There you go. Let's see a little bit better now. The lights on. Thank you. This stuff is awesome. Oh my goodness. Thank you. They were really, really good cookies. I'm not kidding. I'm going to have a wash down with a little bit of this. Uh, Bella General Diet Cola, zero calorie. <laughs> so here it is. I thought I lost the tie down to that. <clears throat> I'm going to tie this up before I lose any cookies. No, that was incredibly kind of them to send those over. I'm going to call them up and thank them. Like good people for doing that. And it's always nice because, you know, it's just me and my dad. I don't see, you know, I don't see my mom. Or, I'll see my sister a little bit. Uh, I don't know what's going to happen on Christmas. My sister has to work on Christmas. So. <coughs> I'm going to probably just see it be a very small thing between my dad and myself, probably. And, some, and a lot of phone calls, probably. That's what's going on right now. And then I'm going to do this review. From Walmart. <coughs> and these are <coughs> the Flaming Hot Munchies. I mean, this is the Flaming Hot. This logo is owned by Cheetos, but there's like four different items in here. 
There's Cheetos, Doritos, Roll Gold, and Sunshine. Oh, wow. I think this was three bucks at uh, Walmart. And on the back, it has some information. And it says, inside this bag, you will find a snack that is loved by everyone. That's because every time someone grabs a handful of free lays munchies, did I say munchies? I think, I hope I said munchies. Free lay munchies snack mix, they get a different combination of Cheetos, Flaming Hot, flavored snacks, Sun Chips, Baja Picante, flavored multigrain snacks, rolled gold, plastic tiny twist pretzels, and Doritos salsa flavored tortilla chips. While those snacks is everything, everyone's favorite all in one bag. <coughs> Whenever your friends and family want something unique, it's time to get out the munchy snack mix. And we have uh, little pictures. The Cheetos, Flaming Hot, Sun Chips, uh, what that, Baja Picante flavored multigrain chips, Roll Gold, Tiny Twist Pretzels, and uh, Doritos Salsa flavored tortilla chips. This is pretty cool. I said it was a big close up of what those snacks look like. Right there. So let's open these up. Let me get another sip of coffee. I'm kind of thirsty. <laughs> oh, here's what they look like on the inside. They look pretty neat, you know. Now that's probably the best, you know, because I've been doing this, this is probably the best inside looking chip shot I've shown before. You know, I, I got this idea from the Got the Munchie show, everybody probably knows that, but this is pretty cool. That's what they look like on the inside. See, it's, it looks like it's deeper in there, but it's only that full. Well, I mean, it looks, it looks less full when you show it that way on the camera than it really is in real life. Well, I've... You know, I mean, outside of the camera, you know. Alright. Well, let's cut these out. Here, one of the Doritos salsa picante. Yeah, I believe that's salsa. Yeah, well, salsa flavored chips. I know. Try another one. Here, one of the sun chips. Uh, Baja Picante flavored multi green snack. They're pretty good, too. Of course, the roll gold pretzels, they're just regular. And of course, the start of the show, the flaming hot Cheetos. Let's get a whole bunch all together. Oop. Fooled you guys. Uh, now my dad uh, needed something so I had to cut the review short and then go uh, go check on him and then come back and uh, finish my review. I'm going to have a little more sip of pop. I forgot to put this. This is one that I finished the other pop. This is one that uh, I actually ain't left out. Still open. It's a little flat, but it's still good. You know, try it, but it's still good. I might put it back in the fridge like get a little colder though. That's real warm now. Like I was saying, let's have a big. Uh, not super big, but let's try to get. Yeah, they got a whole bunch of things all at one time and try them out.
Now, one thing about this is I, there's four different items in here, and there's four different, completely different items, and there's going to be some of a mixed review. Uh, definitely the star of the show, I said before, Flaming Hot Doritos, that's the best part of these, the snacks. Um, Rogue Gold are fine, but I'm just kind of average tasting uh, pretzel, but the, I mean, I do like Rogue Gold, but these are kind of average. Same thing with these. You want to talk to Same with Sun Chips. I mean, if the Cheetos weren't in there, these would probably have almost no spice. And the Flaming Hot Cheetos is the only thing I really give them any type of spice. It's not super hot, believe me. It's really not that hot at all. But Cheetos is giving just a little bit of heat to Flaming Hot Cheetos. I'd give, I mean, as a mixed bag, these are okay. I mean, they're not bad. Uh, they're trying to do like that whole check mix thing, I guess, with this. And, they're, and they're, like I said, they're not bad. I, I'd probably give this maybe a 7 out of 10. But, I mean, if you're interested in trying this out, I, you know, I see no reason why you shouldn't. You'll probably, you might like it. You never know. But this has been my review of Flaming Hot Munchies. So, until next time, please uh, like, share, and subscribe. And, you know, I got up and I'm making dinner, uh, breakfast for myself right now. So, that should be good. I, I really appreciate everybody for watching all my videos. And, uh. I want to give a shout out to everyone I talked to on uh, on the hangout last night. Well, first of all, Joyce. Joyce was only on for a few, for a minute or two because she was having problems with her computer. But I wanted to give her a shout out anyway. She's a nice lady, and I, I think she was a little disappointed that she couldn't be on last night. Got Jane Lynn Barton. Say hi, thank you to her for talking to her. Uh, thank you to Robin Scott. You know, and. A big shout outs to Per0066, a sweet, kind lady, very pretty. Oh, you're all, oh, you're all very pretty and very kind. Uh, and uh, once again to Diana, aka Cat W Magic, thank you very much for orchestrating this and being the ringmaster for us crazy, no, for us filthy animals. You're the ringmaster for us filthy animals. I gotta tell you that on the next hangout. That'll be good. I just, yeah. That's that's cool. Uh, yeah, big time to uh, Diane Cat W Magic, a very nice, sweet, kind, sexy lady. So, uh, I think that's it. Uh, I'm gonna try to include like a review of these. <coughs> I mean, depending on the video, you know, if it's like a sweet, if I'm doing like, I plan on doing a fruitcake video coming up pretty soon, probably tonight. Make some coffee and stuff. I'm probably not going to do the... Well, I'll do one cookie and I'll do the fruitcake. And, uh... I think that's about it. Uh, you know, just suspect I, I got some more things coming up, more videos coming up. And, uh... You know, I, I love doing them and I like doing food reviews. I hope you all like them. You know? So, until next time, please like, share, and subscribe. And all I got to do is double one. Take care. Take care of my legion.